Hey, what's up guys? So I have here uh, Neo 2 for the PlayStation 4, uh, a brand new shrink wrap game copy, physical copy. Um, and I, and I want to do, and I wanted to just make this video because I'm actually planning on trading this in since I don't necessarily intend on playing it anytime soon. And understandably so. I mean, I haven't even play the first game and plus there's a compilation a collection on playstation 5 so i'll probably just play it on there if i ever get to this but as for the game itself well what uh what can i say it, it's developed by team ninja the same folks the same guys behind the ninja gaiden series although it should be mentioned that they're not the same people necessarily because uh i th because the original team ninja the specifically the people who worked on uh on uh, the first two Ninja Gaiden games, uh, I think uh, Ita I forgot Ita Itagaki or something like that. I can't remember his name, but uh, he left the company because of a t pay dispute after the release of Ninja Gaiden Two. And after that, well, Ninja Gaiden kind of fell to the wayside a bit, especially with Ninja Gaiden Three Razor's Edge. I I hear that game wasn't all that great from what I uh, from the review scores, anyways, but. What whoever took over from Team Nit for Team Ninja, whatever staff members took over, they went on and made uh, this this series of game which seemed to be pretty successful. So we turn look to the back. We can see um, we got some text here. Uh, it's a one player game, two to three network players, thirty five gigabyte minimum, DualShock Four, PS Four Pro enhanced and online play optional. Okay. Now, let, now I am also aware. I think that if you have a, if you insert this game into like the PS5, you, there's some, you get some extra content or something. Like, you get like the PS5 version for free or something. I can't remember. Uh, please let me know in the comment section if, if, if that's the case. Because I know there are some, there are some games where you can actually get a PS5 upgrade. I just don't know if it extends to this game. Oh, okay. So you got Neo. T okay, so you got the game disc on the right as usual. Nothing special there, but you also have the voucher for some DLC. Uh, gonna be honest, guys. Gonna be honest, guys. I'd actually rather they just put the thing on the disc, really, because I just don't like the idea of having a voucher. Because if you buy it used, well, and especially if the content itself is like a pre-order bonus, you're not going to, sorry, if your content is exclusively a pre-order bonus, you're never going to get that content unless they re-release it. So it's apparently this code expires um, March 13, 2023, which is about nine months from now. Okay. Well, any well, I'm not even gonna hang on to this game. So this code, so I'll just let whoever owns this game next you hang, keep the code, I guess, or maybe I'll just redeem it. I don't know. But anyways, guys, that does it for this video. Really, I don't have much to say um, since I haven't actually played this game or the first game for that matter. Um, I'll I'll eventually get to the first game. Eventually, I mean it is on. PS Plus Premium, but then again, there's so many games I gotta get through because I missed out on like on the PS4 generation more or less. It was only like last year, last February that I February 2021 to be specific that I got my PS4. So I came into this generation pretty late. I still got a whole bunch of other games to get through. So with that said, guys. Um, as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.